Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. I, I, I would like to uh, say that one more time. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. All right, so proud to say that Hubbard Middle School, as of the effective as of June 30th, will no longer be a status school. Let me say that one, one more thing. One more thing. Hubbard Middle School, effective June 30th, will no longer be a priority status school. So it, it gives me great pleasure to introduce this young man who over the last three years has been, as we say, rocking it. Academically, just doing his thing. Now, I want to read his quote because I think it's, it speaks volume to who this young man is destined to be. People describe me as a crack in the pattern, and I like to think that I am so. With that thought in mind, I persevere through everything. People sleep to see their dream, but I stay wait, I stay up to work on mine. Now, when you have an eighth grader, an eighth grade scholar, who is very cognizant of who he is and embraces it without apprehension, I have no doubt that his desire to become a future entrepreneur or a stockbroker is definitely in the cards for him. I want to welcome to the front Mr. Derek Nelson Lopez. Come on, Derek. My pleasure to introduce to you Maxwell Middle School Student of the Year, Ms. Chelsea Young. Ms. Chelsea Young, can you come forward, please? Ms. Chelsea Young, Maxwell Middle School Student of the Year. Let me just tell you a few things about um, Chelsea. Chelsea is a member of the National Junior Honor Society at Maxwell Middle School, who have excelled in her academic despite being a year younger than all of her classmates. Chelsea has a wonderful public speaking skills as evidenced by her memorable performance in the Black History Month program and her performance as a narrator in the school play Into the Woods that just happened a few weeks ago at Maximum School. She has saved superb levels of integrity and dedication to her education and is a wonderful example of the promise of our next generation and reinforced the critical work that is taking place in our school a classroom and in her house every day. I'd like to also recognize the great work that the young family is doing with this young lady. It is a pleasure to be associated with the family and with Chelsea. This young family, this family, you recognize that you're doing a great job with this young lady.